hello everybody, it's great to be back. How are you all doing today? Oh, wow, looks like our chat reader is broken, but that is A-OK. -okay. <laughs> it matters for not, because we are going to be checking out Assassin's Creed Origins today, which is a game, or I should say a franchise, that I have kind of avoided in the past. I have, I'm not the biggest Assassin's Creed fan, but there's a lot of hype surrounding this game. It's supposedly pretty damn good. Um, see you as well, Eakin. Enjoy. Enjoy the Ban Oasis, you and Steen both. It is great to have you all back here, Elvar. Don't go saying those conspiracy things. No, no one will believe you. Especially when there's such a power dynamic. I'm in control. <laughs> How could little old Elvar have anything? No proof. No proof that I'm a square. Absolutely none. Uh, anyway, by the way, cheers. Cheers, everybody. <laughs> the PLN on Steam, by the way. Hype, hype indeed. That's awesome. Did it end up being good? Um, like, all of the, all the little different things that um, they were planning on implementing. <laughs> and again, Egan, it is great to have you back here. I mean, I see you managed to stay awake long enough. I hope you are feeling a bit better. I know you were sick the other day. But yeah, let's go ahead and check this out. That's a bit disappointing. We need to look into that. I wonder why that's broken. Streamlabs is off its game today. Off its game indeed. Chain rates is like it was leaked. So that is amazing. Wow. You are getting games so much cheaper than I am or anyone else. <laughs> so I'm going to be buying all my games through you now, Elvar. Um, I will be sending lots of money your way. But yes, let's go ahead. We can keep this conversation up. But let's go ahead and jump into Assassin's Creed Origin. Let's see how it, let's see how it goes. Let's see how it turns out. I'm pretty hyped. It's been a long time since I played an Assassin's Creed game. Um, so yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Pog Champ, indeed. Cheap games for the win. If Assassin's Creed will ever load. There we go. There we go! It's coming. Maybe. Steam is super derpy though. Like my games on which let's display with Euros. When I go to the games to store, it's it is in PLN. Oh weird. Alright, there we go. Read before playing. Flash sensitivity stuff. All that. Here we go. We'll we'll let Eakin back in. He didn't deserve the bad luck that he got. <laughs> oh, it is a great day to be streaming, to be playing video games, and to be sipping some wonderful coffee. XD indeed, Eakin. Welcome back. So yeah, there's been some uh, a lot of stuff going on with the new Star Wars that was released. People are flaming the heck out of EA. They got the most downvotes of any post on Reddit ever. That's a lot of downvotes um, for for their their system they've implemented. It seems like like Assassin's Creed Origin is 60 euros, so it says, let's say near automa auto automata. I, I cannot say that game title for some reason, and I don't know why it's weird. But I know what game that is. I just, for some reason, can never say that title. You know, it costs 216 and Assassin's Creed Origins costs 250. That is weird. I guess they'll, I'm sure they'll patch it in eventually, or not, because it's Steam, but it's like that. Seems like new releases for 60 euro cost 250, and old 60 euro releases cost, oh, okay. So everything previously is still going to um, remain the same cost. <clears throat> so I, guys, I am completely going into this completely blind. I've seen barely any of the game in other streams. The only thing I've pulled up is... The only, the only times I've been in this game so far are to open it up to make sure it's being captured correctly and to make sure the subtitles are on. So, we're gonna see. We're gonna see. And I'm gonna double check anyway. Is being captured correctly. PLN. I think that's a local currency. Polish currency. Square? Why didn't you let me back in? Steen, I did let you back in. And, I, and my name is not Square. Isosceles Square makes no sense whatsoever. I'll have you know. 
Um, PLN stands for the PlayStation Network. It is a Sony thing. If you're on a, if you're on a. Steen, I let you back in early as well. If you scroll up through chat, it will say Steen is no longer banned in the channel. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I am a wonderful presiding benefactor over this stream, and I would never let you down like that. I don't pick favorites. Seems like people like your theory. It does seem that way, and I'm going to have to start doling out bans left and right if this keeps up. <laughs> Square eye. God damn it, guys! <laughs> I'm going to ignore that. I'm going to ignore that, Ekin, even, even after I've already said it. And I'm gonna <laughs> I'm going to click play here and see how this goes. New game. Should we, I think I think we'll do an easy playthrough. That sounds good. Just walking through the game. We're, we're probably going to do it on easy. That sounds... We'll, we'll do that. Ooh. Ubisoft presents Siwa Oasis 49 BCE. That's a long time ago. Whoa, that is cheap. Wait, wow, that's super cheap. LR. So for those that know Assassin's Creed, what Assassin's Creed is this? Like, like numerically, because they don't, they stopped numbering them, because it would have gotten obnoxious. Elefante! They're so cute. Holy shit. Steen, thank you so much for the $3 donation. I'll read that out in just a second once this cutscene's over. One year later. The Bent Pyramid. You are the Magi from Siwa. I thought Magi was supposed to protect the Pharaoh. I am Magi to no follow. <clears throat> you see this? I can read my own name, Nat! We will find you. We will find you in your sleep! Woo! That is a mask right there. Sleep. I never sleep. I just wait in the shadows, and I will kill you all. Everyone who slipped the air that day in Siwa! Oh, ow! That would hurt so badly. By the way, hello, Reza. Walk like an Egyptian indeed. Steen, thank you so much for the donation. Bald in 2020, you say, nay, I say to that. And Reza, hello, welcome back. We are walking like an Egyptian, and we are... Doing a tutorial. That's what we're doing. Is there a dodge button? There has to be a dodge button. Oh god, this looks so good! I'm excited! We're just starting it! It looks pretty damn good. I'm excited so far. 
Who is this guy we're fighting though? That's that's the confusing part. Hmm, hmm indeed, Elvar. Ooh, framey though. It looks good, but framey. Okay, shift to perform a shield break. Let us come truce. You are not the one I saw to kill. Question of order. It is a fight to the death. So be it. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah! And we fell! Fall like an Egyptian. Yes, apparently. Oh, there we go. That's dodge. I figured it out, chat! It's almost like this tutorial is designed to teach me what to do. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Merville. Hello, Reza. Dodge like an Egyptian, fall like an Egyptian, all of the Egyptian things, and this guy's gonna die like an Egyptian. Actually, no. I don't, I don't know how Egyptians died, but we, we killed him. We did. And we have a heavy, blunt, level one weapon. Oh, cool. <laughs> all right. Um, go unlock this. I guess this is our bow slot, probably. I'm purchasing what we had to purchase the weapon bearer skill that seems strange I'm getting we probably we probably purchase it with in-game currency I would guess <laughs> and respawn like Osiris damn right throwing that in that legit Egyptian mythology in there I like it oh we could do an unarmed fist run that sounds awful uh, okay critical hit 38, 37. Okay, so this is not that. This does slightly more damage than our bronze sword. But it's very slow. So we don't want that. Let's let's keep this. E is store. I don't want any of these. <laughs> We're gonna avoid the add-on packs. How about that? Overly the peel in changes. Hugely in plus so far though. That is awesome! I would say cheaper games are always a huge plus. <laughs> always. I think it's one of the masked ones whose name was mentioned in the tragedy at Siwa. Okay. Let's keep going. Ah. Now let's keep going. Yeah, we're gonna keep our bronze sword. We don't want that weird club he had. Nick. No way out. Oh, we can carry people's bodies. There we go. It has been so long since I played an Assassin's Creed game chat. Like, probably Assassin's Creed 2 or 3. Use Animus Pulse. Wait, that's Crouch. Ah, it gives us items. Or it shows us where items are, I would guess. Ah, an escape! Very nice. After we, of course, loot everything in here. I wonder how we sheath our weapon. I wonder if breaking, like, vases and stuff actually gives us anything. The inconsistencies are really weird, though. It's something you definitely did not expect, like, 50 or 60 euro games should not differ in price between themselves. I don't know. <laughs> Elvar, I have to say, where Steam is involved, I definitely would expect something like that. Especially since it's a... I mean, changing all the currencies over like that is a pretty huge, uh... Undertaking, actually. Seeing as, as there are... So many games released every Scarab single day. Coming from somewhere. Scarab Beetles, that's cool. Anyway, how is everyone doing today? It is great to see you all here again. Um, real quick, I'm gonna check and see where, if there's a sheath weapon control. Light attack, aim, shift, heavy attack, dodge, shield. Huh, doesn't look, doesn't look like there actually is. That's kind of bummer. It's kind of a bummer. Anyway, let's go. Let's go through this passageway. Pass through the crack. Yeah. Cool. One to pull torch. Oh. Cool. Hot keys. I like it. 
Well, the last games weren't that good. Reza, I agree, and that's why I haven't played one in a very, very long time. <laughs> that is exactly why I haven't played one in a very long time. Alt is vault? That's a weird control. Okay. <laughs> I actually, uh, g uh, being genuinely honest here, I don't even know which number Assassin's Creed this is. There's been so many. And I haven't played any of them. <laughs> that is a good point. Neo and Far Cry Prime will both cost 50 euro. So why does Neo cost 20 PLM less and both Nier and the newest Assassin's Creed are 60 euro? That is a good question, Elvar, and I cannot answer that, unfortunately. I would <laughs> take that up with Steam. Blame them. No, don't. Maybe file a formal complaint. Centuries upon centuries ago. Good news is Neo is cheaper, and Neo's a great game, so go for it. Oh. Ah, oh, we can just loot things. We don't actually have to break everything. That's kind of nice. I saw there is a stat that lets you auto-loot things, and we may work to that. There are some very significant RPG elements to this, uh, this Assassin's Creed, which are fairly new. And so we may be... We're, well, not maybe. We're definitely going to be messing around with that quite a bit. The riches of the Five or six. The last really great one was the one in the Caribbean. Stop counting after that. I think you mean Black Flag, and that was, I think, two games ago? Maybe three games ago? So, yeah, wait, there's a lot of them so far. And you're not going to flame them. All the prices are cheaper than the old Euro games. That's true, Elvar. That is true indeed. Wow, there's a lot of... I kind of wish I could... kind of wish I could pick all this treasure up. Money. We got a, a pot. A teapot! An old Egyptian teapot and some iron. That's cool. Played a bit of two, but never really got attached to the gameplay. I got more of the Shadows of War um, take on this type of game. The enemy... Army angle is genius. Well, we're gonna see, because like I said at the very beginning, I don't know a whole lot about, oh. I don't know a whole lot about this game. I am, I went into it, I'm going into it fairly blind, which is something I, I do like to do. Um, I do know that the mechanics are a lot better and there's more of a, more of a story and more of RPG elements. Um, so I'm excited. Loot the, the lot? We're gonna loot the loot and the lot. We're gonna loot all of the lot loot. Looting. Maybe. I do like this scanning thing so far though. It's kinda cool. It literally likes a it literally lets us loot. That's kind of a mouthful. Literally lets us loot everything. We just automatically identify where all of the lootable objects are in the room. Definitely streamlines things. And I'm not sure what I don't even know what we can spend this currency on, but I'm excited to find out. You own like three Assassin's Creed games, but the only played Assassin's Creed 2, you got bored quite quickly. Yeah, that was my experience with every Assassin's Creed game, game that I played, which was the, the older ones. They just were not compelling. That's a good way to say that. Not compelling. But there's a lot of loot. A lot of loot. <laughs> El Rota, hello, and welcome back from the baby rage and chat. There you go. <laughs> okay, let's uh, let's try and find a way out of here. Oh, just kidding. There's more treasure up here. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Hmm. What is, ah. There's so much gold, I just want to steal it. I want to loot the lot of loot. But it doesn't let us. Guessing the way out is in the direction of all the rest of the loot. Can we climb this? We can! Wait. Oh, we can't climb this. Just kidding. Can we climb this? Yeah. Oh. There we go. We can climb anything, chat. We can climb anything. 
not anything, but a lot of things. We can climb a lot of things. Born to loot. That is, that is my name. My name is Isosly Born to Loot Triangle. Jason Born to Loot, more specifically. All right. Alt to jump. We. Oh. This is cool so far. So we're like inside of, of an ancient Egyptian uh, pyramid, it looks like. And I think it, during the loading screen, it said the Bent Pyramid. I'm sure that has some kind of historical context. And I am ashamed to admit that I know a lot less about ancient Egyptian um, mythology and history and culture than I should, given my, uh, my school background. Don't catch your hair on fire. I think we're fine, probably. Although it is pretty close, I'll admit. Oh, Jasper, hello! Welcome back. How are you today? All right. <laughs> Square. I'm watching you, Elvar. Wait, are we? Oh, we are. We're, we're back in the same... We need to we need to get up there. I see the exit. I see it. I wonder if we can climb up this wall right here. That'd be cool. Oh, we can't. It's kind of a bummer. Maybe these? Whoa! Wow, this is actually so pretty. Holy shit. Although I feel like we should be able to climb that. I guess not. <laughs> so when do we meet Nasty in here? Probably never. I think Nasty is Elix specific, Elvar. <laughs> like in temperature. You're probably right, Elroda. I bet it is. is it cause, especially because we're underground, where it is often cooler, almost always. Helps with preservation. Okay, so we need to go up, is what I'm seeing here. Ah. But it tells us to... Hmm. Oh, there we go, we just need to go, go farther forward this way. Oh shit, cool. There we go. The hardest puzzle in the game so far. I don't know why I just took a puzzle. I mean a picture. Oh, maybe that's my hotkey. Wait, does this do this again? It does do that again. Interesting. Okay, well, we'll be avoiding that one. Hoards all the gold. You wear smog is around here somewhere. Hopefully not. Okay. Drop our torch. I don't want to drop my torch. Oh, maybe that's... Nope. Okay. We're gonna take our torch for now. Might as well. Damn, this is really pretty. Hardcore parkour. We missed no items, most likely. We should be good. Some weakened walls can be broken to create new paths. Yeah. Soldiers. Of course. All right, more combat. Let's go. Now I won't be happy till someone mods nasty in this game. <laughs> Please no. Get him. Die. Watch out. Fire. You are telling me. Oh, this has one of the weird, like, mouse movement lock on systems. <laughs> I think we're not going to be using that very often. Oh, hey, buddy. Yeah. Easy. Easy, Chad. <laughs> 